I love Hounslow because it's a very multicultural place. Uh, we meet different kind of people and uh, from all origins, from all religions, from all languages and the people is very helpful in Hounslow. I love them. When I came here, I was greeted by the government and by Refugees Welcome Hounslow Committee uh, from the first uh, day. They provide me with many help uh, to make me what I am now. So I have the opportunity after a year from being here, I have uh, the opportunity to re repay them. I decided to help others also as they are with me as they were with me and I decided to be an interpreter for Arabian or for Arabic uh, refugees then with the asylum seekers who speak my language also. And volunteering on the whole is a very rewarding situation. You do get that feedback, um, strong feedback um, that it's been appreciated and get fed a lot you get a lot of hugs <laughs> you get a lot of praise you know you do get good feedback from volunteering don't you yeah. so I've got a few schemes that I'm I'm brewing up with there's a, a, a bike hub scheme that I'm that's there's the West London bike hub Winston and I are planning one we're just waiting to find the funding which is a scheme whereby Winston takes people through the process of refurbishing a bicycle and learning how to maintain it and in the end they get given the bicycle. So we're hoping that that will get going in the autumn. And then I've got some other schemes I'm thinking about, one which might be some sort of um, library of, of tools for the people on, on that Beavers estate where they've all got gardens but they haven't got lawnmowers and they haven't got tools but if I could find somewhere to store the things and, and a way for them to borrow them um, and then the other one the other thing I'm thinking of is how to help the women use their expertise with dressmaking and tailoring and then learn how to make a business of it